But I do want to, you know, head on over to Evo's Legend side now, as we are going to be talking about Zeiss, who has a few words to say. This roster is much stronger than the world roster. The world roster obviously containing of one Aura, Rekt, Luminaire, and Donkey, the roster that won the M1 World Championship. So that is a bold, bold statement, but it's coming from the coach, literally the same coach that coached the world roster in season four all the way to the World Championship glory. But there's also another comment that he made on stream, Zeiss. Mm -hmm. He said that, Pendragon, the reason why he's playing Pendragon, starting him over Delar, is because Pendragon is smarter than Delar. Well, In what way? How can you say Pendragon is smarter than Delar? This is Pendragon's first time playing on stage. He has never played on stage in his entire life. He has never played in front of an audience his entire life. Ah, no. No man, no man, no man. Uh, yeah, it's Ben Regan's first time on stage, so whatever you see his move, his rotation on stage, it's all stupid. I agree, it's stupid, but don't judge him on that game because that game he really played stupid. It's obvious he's, he's bad macro, bad rotations, but at his best performance in scrims, he plays better, not better, but he's almost the same as Dilar. And why I say smarter, smarter doesn't have to be in terms of rotations. Smarter can be in terms of other things like your itemization, uh, your understanding of the game, how you visualize the game, how you visualize compositions, blah blah blah, etc. Orifier has always been able to find success. This is oh. a part of their five with oh. the help of that call of oh, Hogger. Hogger. B6, B6. And take a look at Beatrice. Kabuki. No way! He will get the shot again as Kabuki will claim the last game. It's a deja vu. And then high, Godiva, it's a blunder by them. Facehugger made an amazing play by getting all the cult ultra HP down, but... The decisions that they make for the players, like who to go down, who to promote, etc., and who to play, isn't from Zace, but it's from the management itself. So it's the full management, apparently, right? So, I don't know. Again, I don't know if it's true. That's what they say. Don't hate on one guy, guys. Like, I've seen so much hate for Pendragon... Dude, the man didn't kick the lar. <laughs> he, he's a player. He gets told to play and he plays. Why are you guys hating on the man? If you want to send hate, if you want to send like threats, etc., don't send it to the players, guys. Don't send it at all, to be honest. But please don't do it to the players, man. It's they're players. They're coming here. It's their job. The management decides whether or not they play. Everyone were, were bullying them in in the chat. And again, if, if it's really the management, um, if the management makes the decisions, the players have nothing to do with it, man. Okay, they, they, come on, man. They're so, they're so young too, guys, right? They're, they're, they're young. They're very young. Their mental state isn't really stable, man. A lot of these players are teenagers, for Christ's sake. My God. It's, sometimes live chat gets really dumb and really toxic. And they kind of forget that, like, on the other side, the pro players, they're humans too, man. God damn, like... I swear to God, these people who are like sending comments and hate hate DMs and hate comments all over, dumbest people in the world. Absolutely stupid. 